Hi Primary Four friends, how are you today? Are you feeling great and wonderful? Wow, that's great. Okay, so today Miss Winda is going to invite you to read a story together with me. Ah, okay, so let me give you a little bit hint. The story is about the sun and the wind. Ooh, the sun and the wind. If we hear the word sun and wind, what comes to our mind? Is it a story about washing clothes and try of uh, drying it outside with the sun and the wind? Or maybe it's about something else. Okay, now let's check this out. I need you to get your Aesop's Fables book and open page 18. In there, you will see a story entitled The North Wind and the Sun. Miss Winda will read the story for you. You can read together with me or you can read after me. Okay, let's get started. The North Wind and the Sun. A dispute arose between the north wind and the sun, each claiming that he was stronger than the other. At last, they agreed to try their powers upon a traveler to see which could soon strip him of his cloak. The north wind had the first try, and gathering up all his force for the attack. He came whirling furiously down upon the man and caught up his cloak as though he would wrest it from him by one single effort. But the harder he blew, the more closely the man wrapped it round himself. Then came the turn of the sun. At first, he beamed gently upon the traveler, who soon unclasped his cloak and walked on with it hanging loosely about his shoulder. Then he shone forth in his full strength, and the man before he had gone many steps, was glad to throw his cloak right off and complete his journey more lightly clad. Persuasion is better than force. Hmm. Okay, so... Um, how do you feel after, it, uh, after reading the story? Actually, I have some questions for you. So in here, we know that the sun and the, the wind are competing uh, and show off their powers. Yeah, so they are going to see um, who is the one that has struck. The stronger, uh, who has the one that has stronger power. Now, I have a question for you. Let's talk about the wind. Okay, so we know that he blew um, furiously. Yeah, so it's uh, as hard as he could. But why the man doesn't take off his clothes? But why the sun that just beam gently at first can make the man to take off his cloak? Okay, so cloak is kind of jacket. Why is it so? So, um... If you want to put yourself in the story, who do you want to be? Do you want to be the wind that 
do the things variously? Or do you want to be the son that just do something gently? Which one that is better? Okay, I need um, to hear your opinion. And after that, I also need you to retell the story with your own words. Okay, so you have, uh, you have finished reading and then after that you can record yourself telling me the story, what um, the story is about. And then you also can um, show me or tell me your ideas about the story you also can answer my questions or you can just tell me everything that you think about the story okay friends so that's all for today i hope that you enjoy and see you next time bye bye